Street Sport Television is brought to you by Collector Car Productions, producers of the Classic Car Auction of Toronto, each spring and fall. Next auction, April 13th to 15th. Visit ccpauctions.com. Hey, you've all heard of snakes on a plane, right? Well, it's our sound in Ottawa. They recently had a snake in a car. Sean's son, Shannon, stopped by in a Nissan and told his dad he had a giant boa constrictor in the dashboard. This is the car, a Nissan Altima. It's an ordinary ride with an extraordinary stowaway. Shannon Atkinson, boa constrictor owner, arrives at his father's award-winning car stereo shop in Ottawa. Sar sound and performance. Hey, Dad, I got a serious problem. What'd you do now? Uh, I lost a snake in the car. What? Yeah, the, my five-foot bow is stuck in the car. Did your mother know? No, not yet. Sean Atkinson, the dad, thought he had seen it all until today. So here's what happened. Last night, my girlfriend and I just picked up this new snake. Lovely, lovely five-foot boa constrictor. It's very strong. Lexi is Shannon's girlfriend. The powerful snake slipped out of her hands and slid up into the dashboard. The snake is a five-foot boa constrictor, the largest allowed under local exotic pet bylaws. We're holding it, everything else. All of a sudden, my girlfriend goes, uh-oh. Uh, I felt bad. <laughs> she goes, the snake's under the dash. I'm like, I'm, I'm sorry? The snake's under the dash. The snake's under the dash. First off, don't have children. Are you sure you got a snake? No, no, I'm serious. We have a snake in here. You don't have a snake in your car. No, it's no, not funny. A snake in here. At first, Sean thinks it's a joke. You have a snake in here. Dave! Ah, grab me a number two, Philip. Dave is Sean's right hand man. As a team, they're tough customers. But the snake is tough too. Aren't you supposed to be at work? It's dangerous in there. Wiring and sharp metal are real hazards, and Sean does not want to hurt his son's cold-blooded pet. Snakes have no ears, so shouting at it won't help. There is only one option. Rip the dash apart. Luckily for Shannon and the snake, the guys at Sar Sound know exactly how to do that, and they know how to do it fast. The ventilation ducts, the radio, it all comes out. But the snake is embedded deep in the bowels of the dashboard. We had to do uh, a little... A little bit of tearing apart in the poor car. Snakes get into very small areas. Literally, it went from one side to the center of the dash and then back twice. Sar Sound's neighbor, Ken, stops by to find out what the excitement is about. No, we're actually trying to get a snake out of it. Right. You, you don't believe it? He doesn't believe the story because it sounds like a scene from the movie Snakes on a Plane. With the car's interior in pieces, they finally get a hold of the snake after removing the airbag. Okay, I got him. There we I go. Got him. I got him. We got him. There we go. <laughs> there he is. Here. Finally, pulling with even pressure, the boa is recovered unharmed. Don't let your mother know. The car really belongs to Shannon's mother. Hopefully she not. hates snakes. With the snake the safe, car. Shannon sort of vows to be day. more careful from now on. After all, boas can live to be 30 years old, so the snake is going to be around for a long, long time. No, now we got him out. We're going to carry him a lot more carefully next time we need to do that. <sighs> Come to work, figure you're going to be working on cars. You know, you take the odd car apart, put it back together, maybe do a stereo. I gotta tell you, this this new one, it's not very often I get to pull a snake out of a car. He thinks I shouldn't be driving and having stuff like that in the car. So I guess I won't be driving any of his cars anytime soon. <laughs> Hard cars always whenever they walk away and leave me stuck putting the rest of it back together. As usual, Dave is the unsung hero in this ordeal. Hey Dave. What? You done yet? It's up to him to put the car back together. Talk to you later. He fooled. Shannon's mother finds out what happened. Don't go away. When we come back, we'll stick with our snake theme and show you a monster truck built to promote the movie Anaconda. This has been a Maverick Multimedia production.